for like learning neutral, but she's good for like doubles because she could do just, her knockback does all the same th stuff. While as Marf, you know, it might backfire with Lucina. It just sends him the same knockback, basically killing. And I used to main Lucina, so like a uh, forge, like um, I don't know even if it's fully charged forward smash, but it could kill like at the edge of Smashville at 72 percent. So Lucina, uh, she packs a big punch. And with Mario, it's also a good combination because, you know, Lucida, she could just rack up that damage, and Mario, he could just try to get the kill. Start wombo comboing on some people. Oh boy, I've seen wombo combos like this before. Oh, here we go. Bartender, make it a double. The doubles bracket is underway. Here we go. Uh oh. We will get the scoreboard up for you in just a second, but right now, it's a standard doubles action. It is four players on the on the screen at once, and, well, it's Smash Brothers. It's pretty hectic. Yep. And just like typical Smash Bros. matches, it's on FD. <laughs> there you go. Both, uh, all four of these players playing for glory for sure. Mega Man <laughs> and Captain Falcon on the blue team, Mario and Lucina on red, as mentioned before. Oh, nice down. Ooh! Oh. That read could have been dev that was devastating if the Falcon would have got it off. Well done by, uh, well done by Wawa Peach to get back on the stage there, but, yeah. uh, Perhaps uh, more could have been done to Edgehog, but uh, I'm sure. Oh wow! That yeah, Good that throw. yeah, Lucina. Um, I could tell she could just grab from like pretty far away. But you know, the, you always have that little doubt in her. Uh, like, is she gonna make it back? Oh. There's places where she could come back, but then dies. And already, it's already just escalated. Oh, and oh. here we go, the double! Wow, goodness the double gracious! Double whammy! Double whammy! Let's go with that. But trading stocks there, Mar uh, Mega Man and Mario. So gonna have to see exactly how this shakes out this is the uh, this is quarterfinals action here at the uh, at the laboratory Ooh. here in Hapro Pennsylvania good trade good uh good stock take a, there yeah it was a back throw actually and I think Wawa Peach probably missed DI'd it maybe you never know but that uh, Jack with that Captain Falcon hanging on at 133 is uh, oh, persistent man. if nothing else but still getting in a good little forward smash there you can say that again but Oh, but the thing is, oh. Wawa plays like a really good team player. It doesn't matter who he's with; he plays really well, no matter what. He is truly a good doubles map player, he, and he, he's a formidable foe to be, you know, faced against. It's a good backliner, like yeah. uh, like would be in a in a team shooter or something like that, like yeah. Splatoon, for example, which we'll be streaming tomorrow. Oh wow! Yep, absolutely. Ooh, the up smash. Oh wow! And he was getting up there in percentage, so that's not a shocker, but uh, Mario, not a character you want to sleep on. Yeah, especially with that up smash, which is so fast, you can just keep doing it. Oh. Lucina gets another, oh wow, that's another stock taken there by uh, the blue for, team uh, for Wawa Peach, and not looking all that great for them, but, oh, oh. takes the... I think he, uh, I maybe just missed either bad DI or maybe just, you know, the underestimation of um, the hitbox when Mario does his back throw. Perhaps we didn't respect it enough, we won't know, but uh, when you're talking about a character like Mario, who really is the basis of what makes up a light or a heavy character, really is true neutral when it comes to yeah. that regard, still has a little bit of punch to his uh, to his attacks. Yes, he's a, he's a force to be reckoned with, too. Ooh. Got ourselves a conga line of, uh, of pain here as we got <laughs> blue, red, blue, red, and really just uh, enemies on all sides here. Not all quiet on the Western Front. We'll see Mega Man can recover. Yes, he can. More like the Eastern Front because on the right side. We are going Ooh. to ignore that, and we are <laughs> going to keep on with this action. I do appreciate the effort. Don't get me wrong. But, <laughs> oh, wow. Mario eventually getting knocked out. Good good smash there. Oh, man. Leaf Shield employed by Mega Man. Of course, one of the power-ups that makes Leaf up Shield's good uh, because Mega Man could just roll, and the hitbox is there to protect him. So, that's... Oh, oh man. Oh, wow. There it is. We are all square, one stock apiece. The blue but, team's right. having a bit of a disadvantage, but that, I mean, Jack uh, could totally make this comeback because Wawa Peach just has such a high percent. However, the up smash by Mario eventually taking yeah. out of. Oh, but Lucina as well, so it comes down to. Comes I down don't know. to. This uh, match is pretty bad for Falcon. Coming down to Jack playing Captain Falcon, Redeemer Z as Mario. It's just a one on one contest at this juncture. And you're Ooh. absolutely right. Ooh. The juggles. Oh my goodness. The problem is Falcon's such a fast faller. Mario <laughs> could just keep on comboing him for ages. However, this isn't entirely impossible. 
Absolutely, Ooh, but the way box. that the way that some of those uh, upward strikes sends uh, sends his opponent in the air, you'd think that Mario might have the advantage just in uh, just in singles. It's very easy to combo with Mario. There you go, Ooh. an aerial show and the up smash, up smash. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, seems like Jack. Oh man, this could be all she wrote for Jack. But Jack hangs on. Redeemer Z oh. still in, still in the driver's seat at 35. Can't be that easy to gimp. Uh, what the what is essentially the true neutral of the game? Totally, Ma Mario K has so much option to come back. You know, it's pretty hard to get Mario sometimes. It, he may look easy, but when it comes to gimping him, it's pretty hard. Here we are. Oh, the, the grab throw, employed, and mighty. there it is. No, um, one sixty-five. Oh wow. Ooh, the well, fireball to not get him. Oh wow. Oh, I think he teched it. up to the to the platform, but that is all she wrote. It is Mario, and it and is in see. fact, it is in fact Redeemer Z and Wawa Peach taking the first game of this best of three set. Not to mention, though, I mean, Blue Team put up a really good fight at the end, but uh, at the end of the day, the Red Team just gave it to him. <laughs> I mean, there's only there's only so much you could do. I mean, it was the uh, it was the it was the support character for Lucina getting knocked out second, support character in Lucina getting knocked out second, and then Mega Man, well, uh, the first one to go, and then it came down to that solo matchup, Mario yep. and Captain Falcon, and you can, as and you said, there's only so much Captain Falcon can do. I mean, Falcon, I feel like he, his options are just so limited against Mario. Mario could just really not do whatever, but he could just do. Oh, he's a lot more safer when he's fighting against Falcon. A lot more that he can, that he can do individually. It's a yes. bigger, bigger uh, tool set to draw from. Mm -hmm. While well, as Falcon, you know, he doesn't really have much options to fight back. But we're, now we're going to game two, and we'll see if that Falcon has a chance. And Mega Man against Redeemer Z and Wawa Peach. And we appreciate you rocking along with us. Twitch.tv slash bros underscore calamity. Game two of this doubles bracket winners quarterfinal match between Redeemer Z and Wawa Peach against Jack and Maverick Hunter. Maverick Hunter playing that Mega Man, getting juggled by Redeemer Z. We saw a quite a bit of that in the uh, the first match. Yes. Mostly because since, since Mega Man's a heavyweight, Mario could just abuse him like that and just keep, you know, getting with those up airs and those up tilts. Mario could just do so much off of like his moves. It's just amazing and it feels polarizing. But just remember, Mario struggles with rage. No, not rage. Range, my bad. Um, and if you just abuse that, Mario is not as much of a threat. As you mentioned, the knockback capabilities of uh, Wawa Peach and Lucina coming into play there. Got off to a bit of a slower start than uh, than Wawa Peach would have liked, mm -hmm. to be sure. But uh, oh man, to come into play Red just team a bit already there. lost. Redeemer. Wow, already Redeemer Z taking a stock, uh, taking a stock hit. And it's uh, both blue team members at 100% may not very well be for long because that, those are two characters that you do not want to be on the wrong end of the smash from. Oh, yes, especially from Lucina and Mario. Mario's got that up smash and Lucina. Oh, oh wow. Takes Ooh. the stock from, from, uh, oh, man. from Wawa Peach. But, uh, again, that's, uh, that's Jack having the stock taken from him as well. You want in, brother? Talking off, okay. talking off stream, talking to, uh, talking to stream, we're talking in the chat, shout outs to the chat, thanks for hanging with us, twitch.tv slash bros underscore calamity. Oh man. I'm going to be plugging that like 50 times tonight, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> You're and, a good commentator, man. Uh, thank you, thank you, but the, uh, flattery, flattery aside, we're going to get to, uh, the game. Going to get to the game here again, that hand. heavyweight contender, Mega Ooh. Man, but Maverick Hunter, being resilient, 172, DI's back, and He's being very on the persistent platform. in this game. More so than he was the last game. I wonder what um, the... Oh, oh no, my goodness! Fire, man. Super fighting robot Mega Man just... Oh, uh, man. But... On the wrong side of a punch there is Captain Falcon. And Jack... Uh, then so I much think, happened in the last 10 seconds. <laughs> yeah, Jack and Maverick Hunter might be needing to have a talk. But again, it's also Redeemer Z down to one more stock. Yeah. And Lucina well, could very well uh, join with 110%. But again, that knockback capability, not one to be reckoned with. As you can see there, Maverick Hunter oh, off of the platform. No. Not a, much of a chance oh, for recovery, he, but he does. What a DI. Yes, and since Mega Man is technically a heavyweight, he could survive a lot more stuff than he normally can. If he was any other character, but 
Oh, man. Wawa Peach did uh, take a stock hit eventually, so back at zero and one stock left. Oh, and, oh my goodness. And now it's all even, um, one stocks. But the blue team's at a bit of a disadvantage in the red team. Could we see a repeat of game one, or will they defy the odds and take it over Redeemer and Wawa? We'll find out. We'll have to see here, but you're absolutely right. Jack, as Captain Falcon at 119, could very easily be sent flying, especially from the... From the right attack from both of these competitors, Wawa Peach and Redeemer Z. But oh, and there it Ooh. is! The sword of Lucina catches the dome of Captain Falcon, but he's still alive. Maverick Hunter Ooh, controlling nice. that platform. Very interesting use uh -oh. of space here by some of these teams. Sometimes oh, wow. it's interesting. Sometimes you'll see them kind of take their time and be patient. Other times, it's got to charge oh. right in. Really is situational awareness here in Smash Brothers. Oh, the back Smash is oh wow! That stock. Right on the edge of the platform. Not much you can do about that. And it is a two-on-one situation. Can't look good for either for uh, for Maverick Hunter right now. It's it's possible, but it's really hard, especially when you have Lucina Mario together. Oh man, Maverick. I I could, I could just list off the possibilities, but Maverick Hunter is gonna have to pull a rabbit out of the hat here. But oh no, that's it. Oh, there it that is. That is one of the best like stuff you could do as Lucina Mario. I've seen it a thousand times. Like the Mario just throws it off to Lucina, and Lucina kills, or Lucina grabs, and then Mario just does an up smash. You know, there's infinite possibilities you can do with those two characters and doubles, as you saw there. As yeah, absolutely right. Of those.